go. All right, so ready to patrol. Okay, sure. Up. Oh, there we go. Loti's method is too grounded for my taste. I prefer a Terodax eye view. I'll bet that's a Terodax. And I suppose I get on this thing. Okay, let's get on the thing. There we go. Oh, he comes with. And he says... I'll call out the best spots and you can something something. Uh, I have to do something with totems. What am I doing with totems? I don't know. This is like totally not the quest I was supposed to be on. Here's some dinosaurs fighting. I'm not really sure why. One of them said the ancient. So here's me randomly doing quests and getting lost again. That stuff's on fire, but I get the feeling it's supposed to be. Back to Zuldazar. It's a pretty waterfall. What are those little guys down there? Stalkers, so probably spiders? There's a bridge we apparently don't need. Blood gate. Of course, when you fly over it, it doesn't count as having explored it. There's a, another dinosaur down there. I kind of like the dinosaurs. Something just fall over the water? Oh no, it's flying. Okay. I'm wondering if this guy knows where he's going because are I supposed to be doing something? What am I supposed to use here? Or maybe we're just patrolling the border. Uh, there's nothing to click on. Oh wait, there's stuff down here. Uh, okay. Throw it over there. Now I get it. I'm supposed to be throwing those things. That's why he's just flying around. I got distracted by dinosaurs. I'm not even sure what that does after I throw it, but okay. We'll just do that. How long have I been streaming for? Do you mean tonight or like when did I start first start streaming? Oh, that was too far away. Oops, I threw it in the water. There it goes. Do I have enough of these yet? I don't know where I'm supposed to put these. Oh, both? Okay. Um, so since you asked, Mez, um, how long have, you been, have I been streaming for tonight? Probably a little while before uh, you popped in here. Uh, how long have I been streaming total? I think I started like the end of February-ish, maybe? Something like that. Oh, wait. I've got one out of six totems, really? Are they supposed to be on the wall? And I can't quite catch what this guy is saying. I know that he's telling me a story here, but I'm not quite focused. I've only got one of these. What am I doing wrong? Hmm. Well, I guess I'll keep throwing them. out of range. Too far away. Hmm. What am I doing wrong? I doesn't like where I'm throwing them. I'll try to put the map up. Would that make it better? 
Okay, I think I need to drop one over here somewhere. Nope. Might have missed. Okay, I feel like this is another quest that's going to go on forever until you get it right. I'm not really sure what I'm doing. I can exit. I can turn into the terrace. Can that one get there? No. What about that? No. Hmm. Drop six farseer totems. This, okay. The quest in the window says I've dropped zero. Now I've got two. Okay, so on the road? No. Well, I've got two. So I'm not sure exactly. I'll do it this way and see what happens. Nope, it's not going to let me do that. Okay. Nope, I think I need to see where he's aiming me at. It looks like I'm within the range of the little blue area. Okay, maybe this is coming up. Here. No. Okay, maybe over there. Didn't work. I have no idea. I've gotten three. Okay, I'll get there. I just keep going. I think he wants them on the road. Where's the road? Here's a road. Trying to like maneuver this without, I don't know. I'm just gonna aim for the roads. So, oh, got four. Still four. I don't know what he's saying because I'm not paying attention. I'm trying to figure out where these things are supposed to go. I figure it's just storyline that maybe I don't, well, I probably don't need necessarily. He says, something's not right. I sense a powerful source coming from inside Zen Chul. Oh, really? Does that work? No. Um, okay. That's kind of glowy. Maybe he wants one there. Oh, I got it. Okay. Dropping you off with Loti. Let her know the source of all this might be within Zanchul itself. Okay. That part I understand. I'm not sure where he's taking me exactly, but I'll figure it out. Now, is he going all the way back to where we were? Oh, wait, maybe he is. Aha, I have completed a quest and he disappears. Okay, these are neat. Look at this thing, all this like magic floating around in it. It makes a noise sort of like the the uh, spirit, whatever, when you die, it kind of sounds a little like that. Okay, so there's a question mark over here, which should be obvious pretty soon, I suppose. Unless I was supposed to go in there. Oh, here we go. There's something dead here, two of them. Okay, this is Wardruid Loti, Zanchil Council, Zanchuli Council. 
uh, the offensively defensive quest. She says, oh, so that bent tusk nose breather is trying to win you over with a little flight and some charm, huh? And then I can pick an item. <laughs> I can have gloves or I could have a chest piece. Um, hmm. Okay, so the chest piece I'm using has crit and mastery. The new one has haste and mastery. Uh, it's a level 200 though. This one's also a level 200 and it has versatility and mastery and mine has crit. So I'm gonna go with the harness, why not? It's a beta, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Okay, she says, I be the war druid Loti, I am the conduit of Gonk, Loa of Shapes, and Master of the Hunt. There seem to be a lot of these Loa gods all over here. I also be one of these Anjali Council members, but you knew that already, I'm sure. There's two quests here, so I don't know if this is where I'm supposed to be doing quests from, but I'll take it. Okay, this is territorial dispute, like pterodactyl spelled that way. There's <laughs> a lot of little puns in here. The courtyard of Zanchul has been overrun by pterodaxes, driven mad by some dark ritual. Power is coalescing here and it is hard to tell who or what is causing it. I need to track down the source. In the meantime, you take this, the power of Gonk, and call his allies to help you in battle. Slay these maddened pterodaxes. When you are done, tell Rawl to get his flock under control. I have to slay six of those. And there's a thing. I got a thing. Oh, it's right down here. This is a war pack. Summon two children of Gonk to fight by your side. Okay. The other one is called Restraining Order. Some, quote, something bad. That was all Rawl said. His flock of pterodaxes have swarmed the courtyard of Zanchul. They are being driven mad. Shoot them away before they hurt themselves or others. And I have to shoo away 20 little ones. Okay, dokie, she says. So, are you a little one or are you a big one? This is a hatchling. How do I shoo you away? Do I use this? Let's take a look at that again. Shoo them away. Shoo. Oh, <laughs> you just poke them and they fly away. <laughs> Poof. Bye bye. <laughs> Oh, these are adorable. There they go. You didn't fly. There you go. <laughs> Super cute. Um, maybe I wasn't close enough. Okay, and this one. <laughs> I have six out of 20, huh? Okay, there's plenty more that came from. They're cute. There he goes. You don't have to poke them. Uh-oh, this is a big one. Well, I'm going to summon these guys to fight with me. What do I get? Here they come. They're dinosaurs, and they're fighting in tandem. Wow. That's nifty. Let's see what they get from that. A sinewy wing. Okay, let's shoo that one away. All right, guys, come with. I know your timer's going to run out on me, but that's all right. They're kind of neat looking. It's hard to get. They're like very close behind me. Oh, there's another one. Okay, guys, get him. I think they must be on the other side, or that or my dog is taking the aggro for me. Okay, I got two. <laughs> Waiting for this thing to. Load back up. Uh oh. Did I get another big one? No, just a little one. Okay. <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. Bring back the other dinosaurs. Did it work? Yes. <laughs> okay, these are fun quests. Okay, let's go get some more of these guys, shall we? How about this one? Shoot. <laughs> Only 11 out of 20. My goodness. All right, how about this one? Shoo. <laughs> oh, got a big one. Okay. I think I ran out of my little helpers. Oh, I have two. This is not going to go well. Um, let's 
Try that. Got one. I can almost summon those guys, but not quite yet. That's not what I wanted. Let's see what that does. Got him. That's nice. Did I lose them both? I did. Okay. Shoo. <laughs> There's a big one over there. Is somebody fighting it? I don't want to steal it from another player. This guy respawned over here. Shoo. Go, go, go. <laughs> Seventeen. Eighteen. I think I need one more, two more of the big ones. Nineteen. Oh, here's a big one. I'll just take him and bring these guys with me. Go get them. Do you guys not see that thing? Come on. I'm not sure what they're doing. Oh, there's another player that jumped in. Okay. I'm not sure which one that counted for. Okay, I need one more little guy. There's a little guy. There he goes. And they disappear. Okay, back to the question mark. Which is where now? Hmm, up there? Uh, I think this is a fountain. I don't think I can climb that. So I'll go over here. There's a player over here. I can't get up this. It's a wall. I thought it was steps. Here we go. Well, that's not who I need to turn it into. Okay. There's a couple more players in here, I think. I could just be pets. All right, this shiny thing is Dokanu, which I'm still supposed to turn in some kind of quest to that I can't do. And the other one is this way. I think. I still have this thing because I haven't turned in the quest yet. So I guess I could use them if one of those big guys attacks. Oh, there we go. That's the one I need to talk to. Okay, Hexlord Rawl. All right, so I turn in the first one. Did you have to kill so many? <laughs> yeah. And the other one, why are you scaring away my flock? But he really has no idea what's going on. Okay, so this quest is called Competitive Devotion. He says, okay, I know the situation is serious, but she gave you the power of her Loa. Sounds to me like Loti is more big on recruiting than dealing with this blood troll threat. Inside the temple behind me are three guardians. When I walked in there, the things tried to kill me. Then he says, me, like he can't believe they would try to kill him. He continues with, someone has corrupted our own guardians. Here, I will lend you the voice of my own Loa, Paku, the Pterodax. Use it to crush this corruption. Slay three, slay the three corrupted guardians of Zanjul. Okay. And now I got his Loa, the voice of Paku, which I think I ran into Paku, so it should be interesting. Uh, there's some dead priests here. Pakua priests. That's not good. Oh, what are those? Oh my goodness. I think that's a guardian. Well, let's get him. Maybe I'm supposed to kill the little guys first. Um, yeah, probably going to die. Let's get Paku in here again. Oh, wow. Okay, that worked. Holy moly. Oh, I can loot him. Inert stone. Oh, I got one. Anything good in here? Maybe not. Okay, going upstairs. I think. 
Gotta get that one. I could just one shot everything. <laughs> yeah, that'd be good. go somewhere up here but are these stairs they are here's another one I can't loot those okay should be something here council chambers some flashy things and some cultists and uh, big shiny fireplace. Hmm. All right, let's go get that one. All right, that one's done. Oh, there's a big one down there. Now let's get this one before he does something why not? Okay, there he goes. <laughs> What's this? This is a guardian of the rights? Guardian of the rights. I don't know if the other one said that or not. Interesting. Okay, let me get this guy, target that guy, and hope for the best. Doesn't look so good. Let's bring him back. So you fire a bird at him and it knocks him down. <laughs> okay, I got an inert stone. That's two. Something's making bad noises. Where is it? And I think I just saw like a carpet disappear over here. Which was a problem in the alpha, but not necessarily this section. Hmm. Well, let's try that way. Get this guy. Oh, hey. All right. You can help. That's cool. Can't go up here. That was a, a way up. Nope. It's pointing me this way. I'm not sure where that guy's going. Hall of the High Priests. Oh wait, there's somebody. I think I might have come in this way, but I'm not sure. Okay, that one's out of there. Guardian of the t of the tombs. All right. Did I already get that one? I think I did. All right. Let's look at the map. Uh, I don't know. I'll just give it a try. Why not? Oh, I think I did get this guy before because it didn't complete the quest. All right, more XP for me. Okay, let's throw a bird at that one. Okay, can't loot them, can loot this. Probably another stone. Yep, yeah, another inert stone. All right, um, should get out of here. This way, maybe? No, that's the door. All right, well, let me heal my pet. Feed him, feed pet. 
Why didn't that, why didn't that work? I don't know. Mend pet? Okay, mend. Well, that was pretty. Can do it again. Okay. Off we go. Okay, so that one, Guardian of the Tombs, already dealt with him. Is there another way? No, only this way. Okay, I was in here before. Is there no other way? That one's still on the ground. All right, let me get rid of these guys. have a bird. Okay. That's kind of pretty. And he's gone. See, I thought this was like, maybe it's an elevator? Oh, it's a hallway. Well, I should have gone here in the first place. And now I'm out here. More little dead guys. Probably the right way. What are you? Crimson cultist. Okay. Something's growling. Oh, well, look at him. That would be a uh, guardian of, what does that say? Guardian of the dead. He's fancy. And we're done. Guardian of the Dead slain. And I get a rock. Okay. There's a question mark up here, I think. All right, who's this I'm talking to? War Druid Loti and Hexlord Rao. Okay. She says, this worse than we thought. Okay. Dire situation. Good news, we found the source of the corruption. The bad news, it's a ritual on the apex of Zanchul. Blood magic wielding heretics are empowering some sort of dire troll up there. How it made it all the way up to the apex without us catching it is something I'm sure Ral and I will be arguing about for the next year. <laughs> and when you complete this, you can get Loti's favorite long spear or Paku's blessed crossbow. I'll probably go with the crossbow. Okay, so I think I go up here and figure out where the dire troll is. Can't quite maneuver to see very well, but that's okay. Oh, there he is. Uh huh. Um, all right. Can I get one of these guys? Yes, I can. Oh, they all disappeared. Hey, they came to help me. This thing is called Degrada or something like that. Uh oh. Get out of the bad. moving. Who turned into a dinosaur? Is that... I'm confused. Oh! Okay. Sure. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I gotta move from the dinosaur before he gets me again. Uh-oh. 
No. This is going to take a bit. Mm, not ideal. Why is this lightning on me? Or not lightning, tornado. Probably lightning we next. I don't really know. Uh oh, out of this. And I have a tornado again. It can't be that much longer. No, 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 no. Is that him that turned into a dinosaur? Oh, there we go. You fight like your sister. You are still not allowed to mention my sister. Okay, those two have a history. Okay, turn it into you. Dire situation. I will not have that blood in my temple. All right, I get to pick one. I'm going to get the great bow. That sounds like more fun. Oh, Paku Blessed Great Bow is an epic upgrade. Awesome. She says, picking a side, look, this has gone on long enough. I am not one to hold a grudge, but I'll be damned if I let you double dip with Raul's Loa and my own Loa. Time has come to pick a Loa. The Loa are not the sharing type. Choose a Loa. <laughs> okay. Oh, look. It's a little dino and a little birdie. Oh my goodness. She says, Gonk, Master of Shapes and Lord of the Hunt, is a powerful Loa, and he prefers his, basically, to summarize. These are so cute! I want the bird. <laughs> She's probably not happy with me now. Picking a side. Okay. There's an option there. If I wanted to choose a different Loa, I could switch it there, but I didn't. She said, your choice is made. Okay. Uh, he says, I knew you'd make the right choice. Come over here and I'll fly you out to see Paku face to face. Okay. Paku, Master of Wings. Come ride Ato the Wing Lord with me and he will take us to Paku. Oh, and mind your manners around that Loa. Paku has been known to drop followers she is not fond of from a really great height onto really hard stone. <laughs> so you're going to bargain with Paku. Okay. Uh, I guess I jump on here, and he's coming with, and this time I don't have to throw anything, which is nice. At some point I should use the new armor and bow that I got. Here we go. Terror rise. Haha, <laughs> terror rise. Okay, so here I am. And this shiny one is Paku, Lord of the Winds. This one is a Pterodax, and this one is Wing Rider Blade Guard. Who doesn't look like a troll. Looks like a dino. All right, let me get closer to this one. There's a little jar down here. Let's look at this jar. It's got a skull on it. <laughs> I think this will take me right up there. Maybe? How close do I need to be? There's little mats here. Maybe Paku has had many visitors. So This is Paku. Look at that. Kind of hard to see. She says, have you come to bargain? But I have to get closer. Try again. Okay, she says, there is a new power in my house. Step forward, Garwa of the Horde, so that I might see you for who you are. A high mountain who is a hunter and a champion, no less. My hex lord tells me, you desire my boon, but I require something from you first, as I do with all those who would deal with me. I require a leap of faith. Uh-oh. A leap of faith? Jump off the cliff. 
Okay, I'm going to jump off the cliff. Which way? This way? Is this the cliff? Oh, I think this is the cliff. Okay, do I die or not? Let's find out. Let's see. Mez, you said you need one for your apartment, but I don't know which thing you were referring to. Uh, if you want to refresh my memory on that, that'd be cool. I'm going to jump off this cliff. Discovered Zoldazar. Here I go. Oh, she caught me and she's laughing maniacally. She says, I did not mean that literally. Okay, she wants a statue. Oh, the skull jar? Yeah, the skull jar looked kind of cool. I guess, I guess this pterodax is going to sort of drag me over here and put me somewhere. <laughs> it's kind of funny. She did not literally mean a leap of faith. <laughs> I've amused a giant bird. Okay. All right, before I turn this in, I'm going to actually like get the armor and stuff that I picked up and try to use it. All right, this is the harness that I picked up. I probably right click that and just put it. Okay, that's a little different. And then there was, where's the crossbow? Must be another bag. Extra thick mojo. I don't remember what that's for. Drape of the Golden City. That's an older one. Okay, here's the Paku's Blessed Crossbows. Let me turn my guy around so we can see the change. Did it work? Is it there? It's there. It's a little different in color. I think the first one was blue. All right, this is the first one that I had before. And then this is, yeah, it's green. NATO. <laughs> okay, cool. Got that. Now I turn in the quest. Hex Lord Rawl. He says, Oh, good. She did not have you dropped. That is a good sign. Come, let us show the public your choice. Okay. Oh, I've got a quest. The Zanchul Council, not a quest, an achievement for quests. It says, The bargain is struck. Now that you have declared a patron Loa for your time here in Zoldazar, you should inform the king of your decision. He will appreciate that you chose to follow the great Paku, and you get Glowing Azerite Geode, which grants 300 artifact power to your Heart of Azeroth, which is the amulet that I'm wearing. I got in a really weird way. Okay, is this the sculpture? I think it is. This is the statue. So let me go over here so I can kind of like take a good look at it. This is the statue for Paku. There's a little guy over here totem of Paku, and I can click on it, but I don't need to right now, so. Well, maybe I should, see if it works. What do you do? Oh, well, that was nifty. <laughs> Sent me up here. Nice. I guess I go talk to the king now. And before I do that, I want to take a look at the achievements. I thought I got an achievement. Summary. Welcome to Zambalar. Now. Exploration. Probably quests. Where's quests? Legacy, feats of strength, world events. Um, quest. 50 quests completed. That's not what that thing said. Hmm. Battle for Azeroth. Ah, and Lar. Completed the introduction quest. I did that the other day. Um, I don't know what that was. Oh, you get a feat of strength for. Picking an allied race. Legacy, nothing. Expansion features, collections, battles, world events. It's gotta be in here somewhere. I think it'd be at the top. No, I don't know what that was. Summary. Okay, it was an achievement that just flew on by. So I'm gonna go talk to the king. And if this turns out that I finished one of the main the, the three quests that I could do, then I might stop streaming because I'm getting kind of tired. 
think I go up here somewhere and then take an elevator maybe. Yeah, there is an elevator. That guy was in a different spot last time I was here. I guess to move around. I don't remember the name of the achievement, but I'll figure it out. I am recording this. I can figure it out later. Uh, go up here, the golden throne. Okay. There we go. And let's see if I have pleased King Rastakhan, who has the best name for a troll king. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. So let's see what he has to say. The bargain is struck. So you have chosen the path of Paku. May the winds of war be ever in your favor. For myself, I follow Rezin, the devil Sar Loa of kings. He and I have not spoken for many years, though. Perhaps I shall pay him a visit one of these days. And you get glowing Azerite geode, which has 300 artifact power to your heart of Azeroth. Turn it in. Ah, well, I've done it, I suppose. They don't have any more quests for me. Okay, so I have done that. This says there's a quest somewhere. Uh, yeah, I have that marked. Okay, um, I think they're down the stairs. Yeah. Grand Bazaar. That's, I think, where I'm supposed to go is Grand Bazaar. What's this? The <laughs> Curse of Jani sits there because I don't know how to finish it. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is stop here because I've been streaming for a while and I'm getting kind of tired and then I make really dumb mistakes after that. So I will come back again and continue on whatever is in the beta whenever I show up again. Sometimes at two in the morning, like California time, sometimes sort of evening-ish. And um, so Mez, if you want to uh, know when I pop up again, you can follow me and you'll get a little notification if you're on and I'm on and that'll make it easier. Um, and I do have, like I said, a video of the battle for Lord Ron, uh, on Twitch and also on my YouTube if you want to check that out. So thanks for keeping me company today, Mez. That made it a lot more fun and I'll see you next time.